So, following that, did actually have to completely run off. <laughs> so it is it's a little bit since last, but Imperator. did it get a chance to look around and just have a see what units we have where. Move we have this lovely new leader. Brand spanking, nothing on him. Ooh, what was that? Ah, Sam Knights, okay. <laughs> and um, also we've got some of our fun units completed. I'm, I'm going to keep this Barbarian Cavalry. To the ships. I'm not too sure what for. Yeah, it'll be fine. <laughs> we might just send this guy off to the Dacians and be like, yeah, go forth. Go forth, little one. But we are now building our anti-Roman forces and uh, always need general fluffers involved. And lots of Principe, no Hastati, thank you. We'll get them built. The thing is, I would like archers, but actually archers aren't that great against Romans. So probably the Velite are going to be better, just for the armor piercing. But it's fine, we'll mostly be using cavalry against Roman forces. Really works out the best. Now, a lot of this is going to be uh, basically just seeing what we can add in for structures. Don't want to retrain them. There's no need. Do need to check very quickly, though. Not there. We're building up. Over there. Villazora. And I think Salona gonna build up yes so let's send General. General. these three off to Salona because that'll be more than enough to get this to the next level and if memory serves we are good no we are good somewhere just to upgrade General. them Attack. first let's deal with some brigands prepare for battle Let's have ourselves a little fight against rubbish. Uh, <laughs> tempting. I just auto resolve this. Uh, lost a few, but it's not too bad. Just thinking that will spread the experience out amongst them, whereas we could like basically build up the cav. Overly needed. Forward. Move uh, let's sir. send him General. back to Athens just to recoup the troops. Perhaps even upgrade a few. Assassin ready. Moving to position. And we'll grab some Aye, boats. Here we are. Actually, let's just use this one. Ready. Aye, aye, we can leave that to Fleet help ready. defend roads. Anyone shows up, we'll deal with them there. Few more turns for that. Uh, Cadonia will upgrade soon. General. Forward. No Them more marching Forward. over. And also Stop. lay a siege. Prepare for battle. Besieging settlement, sir. Settlement under siege, sir. I don't think we particularly need anything in this army to be thrank. Should be able to take them, even if these two armies link up. Yeah, we should be alright. The worst thing comes to worst. We can run away, grab another unit, and run back in. We can only get an extra one anyway. I think I don't think there's anything particularly we could add to it that would really improve our odds. Kind of everything we need to do. We're just bringing soldiers forth. Two or three more turns till they're upgraded, isn't it? Let's grab the building browser. I believe it's this one. Yeah, we'll get our triarii, triarii, whatever you prefer to call them. <laughs> hey, we actually may be able to get a few of them in before 
we move on to the urban cohorts and legionary cohorts. Quick check here, Pergamon. And the reason is that they're actually so useful is they're one of the few anti-cavalry units you can get as Rome, but they get dropped as soon as you advance. So it's always a bit tricky. You usually don't end up getting them at all. Uh, so I wouldn't mind just spending a few turns getting a bunch of them. So we have some anti-cav. Then we'll get urbans. And for here, we might as well just fight this one. We got like 900, about a thousand odd men. They're all pretty beaten up. Yeah, that should be all right. All right, let's fight us on the battlefield. The Dacian horde is worthy of respect, but not fear. They are only men, and men can be killed. They stand alone. No friend has come to this place to die for them. Does this not say something about their honor? They're standing among nations? Are you men enough to win this battle? Are you equal to the challenge? If you are, then plunder and loot await. This is the last obstacle in our way before the city walls. Win here, and you can stroll to your prize. Fabulous words there. <laughs> anyway, let's grab our... You know, I'm just going to call them for what they are. They're distractions. <laughs> our siege equipment are just distractions. That is totally fine. It works. <laughs> and let's grab our skirmishers up. Back they will be in use very, very soon. Uh, and let's build our funny little formation. We'll kind of do. Yeah, so we got some lines to fill in and plenty of cover on the sides. The enemy have brought up more men. Bring up our cavalry. If we can deal with some of these. Honestly, it's, it's mostly like just rubbishy infantry. And actually, I won't move them. By and large, we can get them with just like charges, rear charges, flank charges. The only things you ever need in the total war game. Fast forward a little bit, because we do want them to come to us. Watch these Falksmen. Yeah, they're going to maneuver. Because the main thing is we're going to be trying to kill off these uh, cavalry units and archers and such fairly quick. Push these guys into position. Should have them completely surrounded. Easy break. Build up again. Have to do this piecemeal, unfortunately. Uh, they've now advanced straight into our lines. I mean, the oh, don't even need to. Press forward so the spirit of his army is broken too. I managed to single out this unit. Didn't get the rear charge in, but that side charge, just on the flank, enough to break them. They broke one of ours. How dare they? Cool. We can uh, attack them on three flanks. A target. Ooh, can you get out? Hit them, and that's a lovely surrounding over here. Yeah, they're going to get in place. You guys uh, are actually fighting. Okay, we'll send the cavalry in to help them soon. 
Or we could just kill their general. <laughs> I swear, one of these days I will keep the siege equipment alive. It's fine. <laughs> hey, let's rebuild our formations to meet this new enemy. Mercenaries. I only actually want the cavalry. Pretty you. Let's just start charging some of these guys down. Yeah, get rid of the remainder of the units. Put them back on the ballastay. in this army. Not too much that's good. I want to get caught completely out. The gods be like praised! We did just there. <laughs> the enemy's hearts are full of fear and now they flee! Ooh, excellent, we can charge them in just on the rear. For that archers, yeah that's fine, you can break archers. going to march them in because I don't want them to throw off. I just want them to be in combat. Charge them in. Get in there, guys. Archers. We're starting to fall a little here. Throwing off their javelins. We don't want them to throw off javelins. Alright, hopefully this little charge here. Front and back. General in. That should crack them. The gods have filled the heart of the enemy general with fear. Now he flees the field like a coward. Let's grab one of these. That's all we need. For two to deal with the archers over there. Turn around. Great gods be praised! The enemy general is killed! Fear makes a home in our enemy's hearts! Like, weirdly going our way. <laughs> a bit of a, a loss over here. But that's fine. We've recovered. Yeah, so they've dealt with them. They're running away. Palace is down. Probably good, and let's, uh, let's just kill off all these chosen swords. Oh, and they're out of formation. Oh, and a rear charge. Marvelous. Let's just kill those guys off. The enemy's hearts are full of fear and now they flee. Burn. <laughs> Go on, kill them as well. <laughs> Who's left? Who's left? Be just them. That will be able to reach them. Excellent. A good start. A good battle to get yes, us going. Yeah, we lost a few more than I'd like, but we still did pretty well. Victory! Victory! This land is Terminate them all. Uh, try and lower that culture wherever we can. I have no idea where that is. <laughs> um, yeah, that's cool, actually. We're heading that way anyway. So that, that works quite nicely. Let us... Destroy the sacred grove. Build a temple to Juno. 
cavalry is definitely going to need a rebuild. Our unfortunate artillery there needing a rebuild. Actually, let's, let's find these Hastartes. So we want to get rid of them. Excellent. There we are. Fruits, um, yeah, we can start replacing them with pinch pay. That'll help in the long run. Yeah, we don't need to repair anything because we actually fought outside. You know what, since they're so happy, let's actually keep this army advancing. They can move all the way up. That's six turns, take it in three, that should be okay. Thinking we'll be able to do the, the Senate's mission. Boat's ready. I might chuck him over. Pergamum now, just with like whatever we have. Aye, aye, Captain. No more moves, sir. And let's aye, pop yes, them Captain. as a protection, just in case an enemy fleet comes for us. That would not be pretty. And retrain him because why not? Build anything good yet? It's all siege equipment and stuff. Oh well. Yeah, nothing major over here. Just hoping one of these would be. You've now got to the point you can upgrade your settlement. Yay! Because <laughs> we're so close. Uh, you, what can you do? So we need uh, quite a bit redone in roads. <laughs> Mostly just rebuilding the army after that horridness. We also need to replace things. Can't forget that. Make it all Roman and not Greek. Well, next turn should have an upgrade there. A few more turns off for Salona. Replace over here as well. I think we'll do some stuff to make them happy. I'm always worried about destroying things than just having like an uprising due to it. I kind of want to upgrade out of most of these rather than rebuild them. We can upgrade out of the mines. Yeah. The next level we can upgrade all of the, the other structures. We'll give it some time. We'll see what happens. I'm sure it'll be fine. I right, can't forget this, guys. Move them in and move them to... Th is it Thessalonica we were building? Yeah. Get an army built at Thessalonica. Pretty much everything they need. So... Really helpful for them would be... Do equity. That's four cav. General. Five cav. Ooh, excellent. <laughs> and lots of principe. Love to give them onikers. I can move, yeah, I can move them to Pergamum. Give them the onikers. Which case, just keep recruiting principe. That would appear it. So let's advance. Excellent. We'll take the husband. We need more generals. City expands. Where are we? Croton. Marvellous. 
no more. Yeah, you know, I don't really check these very often just because if you've seen enough of them, like, they do come with, uh, by image, roughly what they are, you can guess. Like, you know, that one's recruitment. This is always something to do with the faction. This is something to do with your uh, settlements. You don't really need to check them each time. At least once you've gotten used to stuff. All right, with them upgrading, we can now go back to a high. Oh, no, actually we won't. We'll stick it low because we want them to upgrade to the next level. The Imperial Palace, not the Pro Consuls. Just have to recruit as many Traria as we can <laughs> before Mark, we lose them all. Moves depleted, sir. General. Keep this chipper chapper Back. moving. We want him to fight and get a general at some point. Or no, we general. don't. We'll just chuck this guy in. Onward. Excellent. Imperator. Onward. He's got a bit of command as well. Perfect. And no Hastati in this army. Though we do have Velite, which I, I, I kind of want to get rid of. <laughs> Fine. Over here, you could use more Principe, really. And a dog, because dogs are fun. <laughs> trying to think of stuff to stick in, to be honest. What can we get them that would really help? An academy would be helpful there. Flowers to build... Colosseum when the time comes. Still do nothing, can't you? Little Lorum. General, forward! Out of move, sir! I bet this place can upgrade before our peasants even arrive. General. We already have more than we need to go in there. Sir. The dog army! <laughs> All the doggies are finished. Excellent. What's in them? I'm really tempted just to send all the dogs at them, to be honest. Assassin ready. It's fine. He's like. Oh, <laughs> let's give a try. Missed. And then let's Zero. grab Zero. all of them. Oh no! I'm very unhappy about that. Any general fluffers? Fair enough. Yes, you have an agent. Your Let's honor. get you. Get you to go check out what the Pontics are doing. I'm kind of amazed they haven't tried to kill off these Greek rebels yet. Aye, Captain. There's our army. Aye, Captain. Aye, aye, Captain. Off the boat. Aye, aye, Captain. No more moves, no. sir. Ready to sail. Aye, aye, Captain. Still over there. General, move out. Sir, if we can sir, get them in, yes, we can. One more unit. What might we need? Uh, two more units, because I didn't realize we have some town watch in there. We can give them some cav. And when they make it over, we'll chuck a unit of like archers in there, maybe? Yeah, I think the archers would be quite helpful. I know Romans are infantry based, but there is a limit. Sir. Now you can march up march. to that Over army, because we don't really need anything else down here now. We can still build at Pergamum. In fact, we will have them upgrading to give us. Ah, almost done. One more turn. Agent can keep advancing. He can go over to the Lavosic, Lavosis, Lavisis, whatever. That place. <laughs> Finally, have a look at this guy. Nothing great. It's, it's usually just the chosens that you have to be a little more creative with. And I think that's done very conscious of the fact we're earning enough to make a ton of armies, but 
struggling to think of where where to send them, what to do with them. I might build up an army in Rhodes. We can send them over to attack, I don't know, Hal Halakanasis. Yes, this place, Kasasasis. We will take Kasasasis. <laughs> Let's get a bunch of Pritchard Bays together. Because these guys, I'm trying to remember, they're usually like light spearmen and stuff. I don't think they form phalanxes. See. It's been ages since I, I last went up against pretty much anyone but barbarians. I tend to always fight barbarian hordes in the in the Rome t Total series. We even include Attila in that, really. Anywho, let's hop along. I don't think there's anything else to do. Maybe chuck this emissary if they've stopped. Yep, yeah, they have. Keep moving over Order. to the Midians. And whoever is over there, our emissary, yes, can just chill. I don't know. Moves depleted, sir. Kind of found all the bases and we've already made trade with everyone we want to trade with, so it's Order. not a huge deal anymore. Engage the enemy! Victory! Engage the enemy. Oh, that little bit more. Couldn't quite make it. How about this army? How are they looking? Not great. Very beaten up. Yes, master. Watching and waiting. Wow, there's nothing in there. Plenty more turns so we can upgrade out of that. General! Forward. Well, they lost their their leader. Rather unfortunate. Yes, they're building up. Oop, wrong button. Uh, yeah, they're building up squalor. Build some stuff to get us out of that. I think the academy will help in general there as well. Might even be worth recruiting some units out of there, reduce the population. We need a ton of equite, so let's get them all from there. And you guys should still be recruiting. Yep, they are. Learn. Mm, yep, trying to find things to do now. Uh, ooh, we'll build temple as well that'll help us keep everyone nice General. and happy Move out. good Pontix is sending in an army to deal with those Greeks I think as long as we keep a defensive force here we can actually focus efforts over here uh, to the south because they don't have as, as good a defense there really I might shift. Are they full? Yeah, they're full. All of these guys out. And all the damaged guys from here in. And, and that town watch. Get them full strength. That's all of them? This is going to be a, a prep episode. Excellent. Upgrade that. We'll pop this back up. It's very high. Because uh, on the islands, like Kidonia, that's basically all we want is just sort of every now and then to be leveling it up. Once you've got ports and whatnot there, you don't really need to worry. One eight, so come on, let's just do all three of them. Upgrade. Go 
all the way to very high. Yes, we can. 1.5% of our population still increasing, so not the best. And over here, we are ready for the assault, so let's end there. We got like one war against barbarian, one war against a uh, civilized faction, <laughs> and I think that will keep us going for quite a while. Particularly the Pontics, they appear to have quite a, quite a sizable army. Uh, but let's uh, let's Onward. oh don't do that. Prepare for battle. Aim <laughs> running all the way around. Oh well. I think even if these guys link up, we shouldn't have too much trouble dealing with them. And we've got plenty enough back here to help defend if we have to. Xantium would fold if they were assaulted, but our navy should be able to keep them out as long as we send some ships over there. I'd send one. <laughs> one boat. To rule them all. We'll upgrade all of them as well while we're at it. Quick check through. Let's see who has what. We are getting a, a little bit funky now. With our finances you can see some minuses creeping in we've got some squalor coming up no longer in the greatest situation but still not a bad one uh, yes let's build our army barracks there we definitely want that yeah about recruiting some triarii and let's rebuild this army now they've all moved up as well all of you, you can fit. Yes, you can. Look at it. Marvelous. Only one set of archers, but yeah, it should be fine. Kind of all you need. Right. Move, move them no over move, here. Sir. Might chuck up a watchtower while we're over there. They are still upgrading. With three spots left. What do we want? We want some cavalry. For them. And one more. We'll go for some archers. Excellent. That should do. Quick blitz through. Making sure we are upgrading everywhere. Put the last things in. Uh, you might as well... Ooh, no, once that's upgraded, we'll then build the, the army barracks. Get recruiting. Yes, this, this, this kind of seems like it. This is good. Don't want that one. Apollonia, what do we want for you? Build an academy. Temples. Keep everyone happy. Public baths for cleanliness. And roads for money. Similar up here, though we do want to upgrade out, so happiness and money. Kind of the same things everywhere. It's fine, it's fine. Oh, why not? Let's upgrade them. Got that much cash. We're down to 30 odd K, but it's cool. We have plenty more coming in. Pergamon, what are you doing? You're building the army barracks. Excellent. And then. Uh, let's go sewage and then a dockyard, actually. They have good sea trade. Don't mind getting some quadreams to help out protecting that. 
Uh, I think that's everyone. Excellent. All good to go. Still be recruiting something, but this army has a lot of Hastati in it. I'm not too fond of. So let's get them some proper infantry and a unit of equite. Yeah, that'll do. Because we don't get any uh, legionary cavalry, Roman cavalry, can't remember what they're called, until after the reforms. Let's just hit end there. Hit space bar so he walks a little faster. Yeah, I'll take the adoption. I just like just keep sending us generals. I'm cool with that. Bibius the Builder and Aulus Brutus. Oh no. <laughs> well, I think this guy is going to be moving straight across. Actually, who is it in Croton? Where, where is that army? We've lost them. <laughs> where did that guy appear? Ah, here we go. Uh, let's move him, yep, all the way back. He can manage over, they manage over Croton and try and lift this finance back up. Or we could send to where we're making money and try and make more money. Like a nice plan. Okay, we kind of have people in everywhere we're making money. Look at roads. Marvellous. <laughs> um, let's just send him to Croton and then try and sort out the situation. Orders. Yep, that'll be the plan. Much longer one turn. Yes. Marvellous. Upgrades for our soldiers. Turns for them. I think that's everything. So let's just look at General. armies then. We've sorted out our settlements last Attack. time. Victory! Forward. You're gonna try and ambush us? Prepare nah, we won't let them. With a all light infantry, yeah. Let's... So let's auto that. Forty odd dead. Victory! Build a watchtower, Build please. Go. Need some more up towards these borders. It's quite tricky as you move no up north moves, in, in Europe. I say England then. <laughs> and you guys need a defensive force. So let's build peasants and town watch. Hold the fort. I feel like we need to get them built up quite quickly as well. Just so we can start replenishing troops, if nothing else. Excellent, they're upgraded. Uh, let's build the port first. That should be good. Our well, profit's gone right down, but we are building a ton and recruiting a ton, so. Sure, it will be fine. Move out. Our right go. there on the edge. Just get better eyes over here. A bit closer. Move out. There we go. Then we can send him round to Sardis. Now they've killed those Greek soldiers off. I'm confident we can hold. Pergamum. So it shouldn't be too much trouble. Yeah, even Hastati, if you stick them near town centre, pretty hard to break. Yes, bring us ports. We need them. I might go the other way around, actually. Market first, then sewers. And 
don't even know what roads would do there, but we're going to build them anyway because we can. <laughs> I think that's kind of it. Just got a lot of waiting. You know? <laughs> Great, and now they're owned by the Skippy Eye. Okay, let's go over here. Hopefully, you can run into some Numidian armies and just organize trade with them. New leader. General, to the ships. I, Captain. I, I, Captain. Sir, I cannot. Ready to sail. Yes, Captain. Up the boat. Move General, him into Croton after. Build our army barracks. And it's going to be quite a long time before we get to the right population level. So that's plenty of time to just be at recruiting like crazy there. See what our armies are up to. Charge these guys. Build another watchtower. Gives us eyes over here. Engage the enemy. I think we'll have to take on both of these at once, I reckon. Ah, oh, that's cool. Yeah, we can do that. I'll let them keep recruiting into there so we can switch them over soon. We doing in Thessalonica. This army's slowly building up. I think we'll wait till the army in Rhodes is built up, and we'll get a few and watch some peasants, and then we'll send a, a force in to attack Alacarnassus. Ah, I got it right that time. <laughs> As we continue to build up in Pergamum. Just hit them. Just hit them. These armies are light spears. Uh, they got some... Yeah, they got some annoying troops. I'm actually more worried about the chariots than I am. Uh, these bronze shields. Mostly because we don't have, yeah, we don't have any ears of our own. See, so, yeah, I might have to get some hoplite uh, mercenaries over there because chariots just get wrecked. They run straight into spears. Huzzah! <laughs> I will end there though. Well, there we go. Marius reforms or Marian reforms. I've heard them being called both. I believe it is the Marian reforms, but it was implemented by Marius. Means we, we won't get our Triari. Oh, well. We can, however, get Auxilia. These guys are pretty good against Cav. Really annoying, to be honest with you. Ugh. <laughs> it ruined my plan. Okay, it's cool. We'll we'll up this then, because we don't need to worry about getting our urban cohort, because we can just get legionary cohort and early legionary cohort. They'll do the job, you know. We do get Roman cavalry now, though. Excellent. That's what we like to see. Equite are out of the window. Cancel them because basically these guys are just so much better. So, so much better. <laughs> and we could also do a bit of upgrading here and there. They don't like that, do they? Get 
armored archers as well. Not upgrade. Let's not get you. Let's get them. And I might even grab mercenaries with this guy when he pops over. So I'll just let the town watch and stuff build up. Yeah, there's not a huge amount more to do now. Combine those guys a bit. And let's have a look over with our barbarians. How are we doing? Ooh, they've gotten ready. They've joined up. They've come out to play. Attack! Let's meet them. Yeah, there's nothing pretty in that. All right, let's fight this battle. Smash their horn. Skip the, the little chitter chatter there. I'm going to spread these guys out a little bit. You know, that way when they charge us with the cab, they'll only be able to wipe out one of them. Because they will wipe us out. But it's cool. Spread these guys out. And where are we? This is do your job. Be annoying and divert the enemy's attention <laughs> and we will send two of these chipper chappers to kill whoever charges into you move them yeah just a bit more central trees to contend with now unfortunately Got all of them. Fire at will. And start. Ooh, I did forget. No, I didn't. Excellent. Although I did not put them on fire. Because it's the only way I've found you can reliably see where they're shooting. I think they are either running away or trying to come all the way around the side. I can't quite figure out which. sure what they are aiming for there. So let's just turn these guys so we're ready to meet them. They can decide what they want to do at this point. What are they? Archers? No. Light infantry coming out. Curious. Very curious. Bring some of our soldiers over to try and catch them in the flank if they end up charging us. Guys, they're just gonna keep charging. Just <laughs> thinking, they're like they're gonna break as soon as they hit us. Terrible idea. Just waste off our javelins, though. Healer, turning, not replenished. Might send this unit. Go, go wipe out the last three. Fast forward. Oh, they're all dead. It's been killed by the archers. Alright, well, let's make a proper setup there. 
this is kind of ad hoc right now. Their position is officially changed. They're going to be coming downhill at us, which is a bit annoying there. Cool, because we're going to build up some infantry on this side. Bring them over there. Okay. We're good. We're set. Passing forward. And killing them? <laughs> they sent like just three cav out to us. Okay. That's a bait. Uh, send a, a little unit to go and tie up them. Run, run. You can come in there. Excellent. Completely surrounded them. Didn't really get much in the way of a charge off, but that should be okay. Yeah. Grab. One unit. Go knock off them. general. We might get a little bit of annoyance from this side. Yep, yeah, there they are. But it's okay, we can take the hit because we're killing a general. Eventually. Four, three, come on. Yeah, one of them's broken. Two, come on. <laughs> the there we go. <laughs> is slain, and now his men fear us. That's cool. All our men can run attack. away. We'll grab the equity when they uh, come back up. Although I think they're running off now. Come on, cavalry. Come back to us. Send our general over here, try and rally them. Then we can just try and pick off a few of those units. Yeah, I reckon they're just going to run off, so probably not going to be able to catch them. Let's go and deal with them. Kill a couple units, and I'll be happy. Plus, then it'll be worth all the cavalry we lost doing this. Everyone charge, see if you can't catch them. Otherwise, I don't think we'll be able to get anything in. E. Close. There we are, just got in there, managed to take out a unit. While the rest of the army Enemy has run away. Enemy army is in flight. Pursue them and drive them from the battlefield. Oh, we won. That's all that matters. <laughs> it actually really annoys me when the AI does that. Out of move, sir. That, that could have been a, a nice way to slaughter them all. But now, now we got to go lay siege. They're going to be plenty more turns. Anything else we can do? There's not a lot we can do. And, yeah. I suppose we should just start building these guys up. Let's get them. Them, early legionary cohorts. Archer auxilia. And we'll build a second army in Pergamum. And we'll move these guys out. Who, I don't know, be really annoying to the Pontics. Like, maybe send them like into the center or something. And we can then leave an army behind to defend with some anti-cav in there. And once Rhodes is done, we can send them across. Yes, this will be a, a properly done war. Full assault. Blitzkrieg.
Take space and run this through, so I think this is going to be the last turn, unfortunately. Where is this chipper chapper? There we are. Without delay, Excellent. Speak with them at once. They'll probably only be alive for a few more turns. But at least we get trade until they die. Because <laughs> this KPI is just going to slaughter them. The uh, Julie I have taken over the islands. Map's going to start to shape pretty soon. So we are going to have to build up forces over here. And I also am going to want something in Egypt before we take on the Skippy Eye. Because it's going to be really tricky killing them all. Julie Eye not so much. They're usually a lot easier to deal with. Attack! Get in there. Settlement, sir. Lots of rams maintain siege. Orders, orders. Onward. Grab this Order. army. Excellent. We can keep them happy while we move out. Get them some more auxiliary as well. Orders. And let's move to Aquincum. I don't know how you pronounce these names. <laughs> we'll build a, a watchtower over here as well, just to try and get rid of some of this unknown, this fog of war. See, they're all building up nice and pretty. That is what we want to see. Get them some ordinary cohorts in there as well. <laughs> and our defensive force is building. Impenable. He's just chilling, man. Come on. One turn, that's all I need. <laughs> Donia is upgrading everything. And over here, we're upgrading everything as well. Uh, now we have the reforms. Let's go to building browser. The army barracks gives us Praetorians, Legionaries, and early Legionaries. And our urban will give us Praetorian, urban, Legionary, and early Legionary. The main one here is actually the Urban Cohort. They are an incredibly useful unit. I believe one of the best units, if not the best unit in the game. Uh, unfortunately, we do. It always happens that it's someone, some Roman faction will have beaten us to making an Imperial Palace. Probably SPQR. It's usually them. Just to be annoying. <laughs> but it's cool, it's cool. Yes, so for next time, we will have to finish off building the army in Rhodes, build up an army in Pergamum. I, I will actually start the war with the Pontics a little early. I can't see them sending these armies after us. And even if they do, we have plenty of soldiers to retake anything we lose, and we should be enough to hold them off. And thinking once the Pontics are dealt with, or at least majority dealt with, we can then start on the Egyptians. Now, to take the Egyptians... One of the things I'll be doing is sending an army by sea right over here. And that's actually how we'll begin. So we get the Great Pyramid and Sphinx as fast as possible. Extremely useful if I just bring this up. Uh, regardless of culture, increases loyalty. So it will just make our life a little easier. Also, when we're over here, we can start advancing towards... Probably the Parthians having this. But the Hanging Gardens of Babylon. That'll be a lovely upgrade. Yeah, most of the wonders are in this side of the map. So the Brutii really do have a, a better time. At least at the start. And we'll, we'll carry on moving against the Dacians. We'll have to go against England quite soon, though. With Tanya. Anywho, guys, those are the wars for next time. Things will start to speed up a little. I know it's been a bit slow for this one. I think that's kind of how, at least I tend to do things, is a very slow consolidation and then a quick build. And then you just kind of repeat the cycle again and again and again. Anywho, till next time, looking forward to some lovely battles. Until then, peace out.